Absolutely not. Point blank. I, I even after that lap, it didn't feel amazing at all. Um, I didn't really think it was anything. Not that fast. I mean, it's almost four tenths faster than I've gone all day. So these guys just worked really hard. You know, it's been we've had good finishes and runs. We haven't got a pole in probably about 10 races, 15 races together. So it's good for these guys for all the hard work they put into it for them to for their hard work to be shown. Um, this place in particular not as important. It's pretty wide. Uh, there'll be top and bottom tonight. So hopefully we made some pretty big swings at it in practice. So hopefully the stuff that we have will pay off for us here tonight. But uh, you know, once the green flag falls kind of uh, up in the air and see which see what direction the car goes. A little bit, you pick up a little bit more grip. You know, the track isn't, you don't feel quite so on top of the track. This place has built a lot of character, which makes for good racing. You know, this, this, the fans here are absolutely probably one of the best we go to all year. But the place has picked up two or three bumps, one off of two and two of them in three and four. You know, it kind of wreaks havoc and you'll see guys rolling the top. The place gets a little more grip. And it's, it's not only grip, but as guys lay down rubber too, depending on which line becomes dominant. You know, it just kind of, as the race progresses, it's almost like the race changes and where you run and where you can run and where you can pass guys. So we'll just see as it plays out.